Hallelujah. 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 Thank God Almighty. Amen. God is a good, good father. Amen. Wow. Amen. Happy Holy Week. Amen. Happy Holy Week, y'all. Amen. Amen. To God be the glory. Amen. This is our Back to the Gospel Revival. Amen. As you heard, we've been doing this. Amen. For many years, over 10 years. Amen. I think we, we year was that 2008 we took that Yosemite trip? I think it was 2008 we took the Yosemite trip. And you heard Pastor L say, Amen, that, Amen, it got hard. Yes, sir. I'm going to be like, I got hard. It's going to be hard. <laughs> amen. When we were just being quieted and letting our situation rain on us. And I don't know what made us start preaching. I don't know what made us start doing it. But we start preaching. I mean, like we, like we was preaching, y'all. We got all these young people behind us, and we just preaching. And as we start preaching more and more and more, the hill got easier and easier and easier. To the person said, our scout said, how are you guys walking up this hill exerting so much energy like that? Because we preach it. We said, Jesus said, we sweat and everything. Amen. And God showed us when you are faced with something difficult. One, you got to look to Jesus. You know what the Jesus, you know what our preacher do? It made us look to him. Yep. Cause I just kept looking at them switchbacks. <laughs> That's all I was looking at. When I took my eyes off the obstacle and the mountain, amen, and looked to Jesus, it made the mountain easy. But also, when we were preaching, we were proclaiming. We were speaking life. And as we spoke life, which is the word of God, and what God said about us, it gave us life. Amen. Amen. We preached our way through. Yes, yes, sir. Amen. I just want to tell somebody, whatever you're going through, you're going to have to preach your way yes, through it. Yes, 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 Amen. You're going to have to testify yes, of what the Lord can do yes, on your behalf. Yes, Amen. Yes, what the Lord said about yes, you. Yes, Amen. Yes, I know what the mountain is saying to yes, you. Yes, Amen. Yes, Don't, hey. Situations speak. Right, right. They speak loud. Amen. Right, sure. That thing tell you I'm gonna kill you. Right, right. I'm gonna destroy you. Right. You're gonna die this. Right, You're gonna right. die that. And if you keep your mouth closed, yes, right. Right. Yes, right. Right. you'll right. start to believe what you're hearing. Right. Yes, because right. faith comes by yes, not, yes, not just the word of God, but anything. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Amen. Yes, sir. Mm-hmm. But when you start to speak back, you tell that thing no. No, you ain't. So you hear what my God said about me? I shall lift. Matter of fact, I'm, I'm going to help y'all. Amen. Just look to a brother and sister and tell them, I'm going to make it. I'm going to make it. Amen. Amen. Tell them, I'm going to be healed. Come on, tell them, I'm going to be whole. I'm going to be all that God be all. put me in this earth to be. Put us in I shall live. 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 I like Pastor El said, we said, we'd be wrong. You would be wrong. Yes, sir. If we don't come back yes, and share it with your people. Yes, sir. Right. And anytime God gives you something, you wrong. Yeah, right. If you don't come back and give it to your people. Come on. Right. Yeah. I need to know what God did for us. Right. Yes, that may encourage me to keep going. Yes, sir. Amen. 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 God gave me a word for y'all tonight. Amen. Us, I won't be before y'all long. Amen. Because we got, amen, really four nights of word, yeah. worship, and witness tomorrow night. Pastor Elder is going to be delivering, amen. We're going to have our foot washing, amen. Friday, we're going to be doing our Good Friday Street Revival on 83rd and East 14th, amen. And then Sunday, we're going to land all this at the lake, and we're going to go up. Amen. 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 
So tonight, I'm just, we just, I'm just setting the foundation. That was my job here tonight. Amen? Amen. So I turn you, your heads and your attention to Matthew 22. Amen. So you can stay right there. Matthew 22, chapter 22. Amen. Verses 34. Amen. Through 40. Matthew 22, verses 34 through 40. Real quick, as you find that, does everybody have two sticks? Yeah. yeah. No. And a, 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 a two little. Yeah. No. Amen. We're going to get them to come around, help her out, help her out. Two sticks. Amen. Two sticks. Two sticks. You should have two sticks. Oh, those are yours. And some I got, I got Velcro. We're going to do some arts and crafts too tonight. Yes, sir. Two sticks. The one cross. And some Velcro. While they handle it out, I'm going to go to that scripture. Matthew 22, amen, verses 34 through 40. Amen. You guys are ambidextrous. You should be able to do two things at one time. Amen. Amen. I'm going to tell you one thing you got to do when you're a child of God. Amen. You got to build and fight all at the same time. All right. Amen. You got to have a sword in this hand. Amen. And a scalpel in this hand. Amen. 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 Matthew 22, verses 34 through 40 reads. But when the Pharisee had heard. Oh, that was, I'm in my right place. Yeah, I'm in the right place. Amen. Yeah, that's the, this, this. But when the Pharisee had heard, I'm in 34, that he had put the Sadducees to silence, they were gathered together. Uh -huh. Then one of them, which was a lawyer, asked him a question, tempting him, saying, Master, which is the great commandment in the law? Jesus said to him, Thou shalt love thy God with all thy heart, with all thy soul, and with all thy mind. This is the first and great commandment. And the second is like unto it. Thou shalt love thy neighbor as thyself. Yes, sir. On these two commandments hang all the law and the prophets. Amen. So thou shalt love thy God with all thy heart and with all thy soul with all thy mind, and thou shalt love thy neighbor yes, as love thyself. Yourself. With this passage, we have brothers and sisters, I want to minister briefly from the subject, the cross is a symbol of love. The cross is a symbol of love. Father, we thank you, we praise you, we honor you. And we glorify you, Master. Oh, I pray that you just speak to your people, Lord. Open up your word and write it on our hearts. Allow your word to revive us. Allow your word to equip us. And allow your word to compel us. In the name of Jesus. We thank you, Lord. And we ask that you do the things in our midst that we can't explain, which you already have. Lord, but we know you did it. Thank you for being present, Master. We give you glory, honor, and praise in Jesus' name. Amen. The cross is a symbol of love. Amen. A symbol is a thing that represents or stands for something. Right, 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 right. Amen. A symbol is a thing that represents something yeah. or stands for something. A symbol is not the thing. Right. That's good, boy. That's good. Amen. Yeah. It is not the main yeah. thing. That's good. Mm -hmm. yeah. But it represents something. Right. Mm -hmm. if, you, if you try, you may not know, but you see symbols all day. Right, that's right. <laughs> Amen. You see symbols all day. If, if I told you who has the golden arch, who would you tell me? McDonald's. <laughs> the arch is not the thing, right, right. but it represents 
Yeah. Right, right, right. Amen. Yeah. Brothers and sisters, we don't supposed to worship the symbol. Come on. Come on. All right, break it down. You and I, brothers and sisters, are, are let me say, we we are representation of God. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. We are ambassadors of God. Yes, sir. We go on God's behalf. Yes, We're not God. Right. 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 We represent God. God. Yes, sir. So, so you don't bow down to symbols or logos. Right. Right. Come on. Because they're not the thing. Right. Right. But you bow down to the thing that it represents. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. And I told you the cross mm -hmm. is a symbol. Of love. It is the symbol, amen, that God showed us that He loves us. Think about it. Love. You can't see love. Love is not tangible. When you say I love you, what is what is that? What do you mean by that? Are y'all listening to me? We all know love is an action word. It's a verb. Amen. But when we love somebody, yes, sir. what we do is give them symbols. Yes, sir. <laughs> Are you listening to me? Because you can't see love. Right. I love my wife, and, and we stood before the preacher, and we got married, and, and I gave her a ring right. as a symbol yes, sir. of yes, sir. my love. The ring is not my love. Right, right, right. It's just saying. You may give somebody a call or a presence, and all this helps them see your real love. It makes a, a, a thing that is not tangible tangible. Mm -hmm. That's good, bro. That's good. Right. So, so when God says, I love you, he showed you the cross. Yes, sir. He made a thing that wasn't tangible tangible. Yes, sir. Are y'all with me, brothers and sisters? In our text, Jesus is being tested by people that don't love him. Are y'all listening to me? They, they don't love him because they're testing him. They don't love him because they're, they're trying to catch him in a fault, amen, and, 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 and have an argument or a debate with him. Are y'all listening to me? Nah. Good, the Bible tells yeah, yeah, us good. Very good. that he silenced the Sadducees. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. They tested him. Uh -huh. And when he replied, uh -huh. amen, he shut their mouth. Yes, sir. Uh -huh. yes, good God. Oh, good God. Uh -huh. One thing God will always do uh -huh. with your enemies and your haters, yeah. he yeah. just shut them down. Shut him down. Yes, sir. Are y'all listening to me? Yes, sir. Uh -huh. That's why he told us you can hold your peace. You can stand still. You don't have to fight your battles. You don't have to speak up for yourself. You don't have to test. You don't have to show people how, how much a child of God you are. Don't you know? No, no, no. Because when God does it, he'll just shut it down. When you do it, it'll go back and forth and back and forth and back and forth. And all we're doing is arguing opinions. But when God does it, yes, it just shuts it yes, down. Right. Shut it down. Hallelujah. Good God Almighty. Praise the Lord. That's why he, even we, when we have people coming against us, we, we got to love them too. Why? Because we understand, amen, when you fight a child of God, amen, that you're fighting God. And if you're not careful, God will shut you down. Yeah. So when God is coming, you got to say, Lord, forgive them. Yeah. But they don't know what even they do. Amen. Yeah. Yeah. Jesus. He said he shut him down. God will let you endure stuff for so long. Use it to strengthen you. Use it to bring out wisdom in you. Use it to mature you. And then when he's done, shut it down. My God. Shut down. And then Pharisees are <laughs> gone. Maybe they're not educated enough. <laughs> 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 we're going to get him with this. 
We're going to embarrass him with this. Mm. Are y'all listening to me? Help us. That's why you have to have a spirit of discernment on who you're talking to. That's good. That's why you got to be slow to speak. Uh -huh. Yes, sir. Uh -huh. And quick yes, to hear. Yes, sir. Because when you're in a conversation, amen, you got to ask the Lord, what is this? Mm -hmm. yes, sir. Have you ever been in a conversation and ask the Lord, who yes, is that? Who is that? Why are they talking, mm -hmm. sharing what they sharing, telling yeah. you this, right. or telling you that, yeah. or telling you yeah. I'm going to make you rich, yeah. or telling you yeah. I got a great opportunity for yeah. you. Don't jump on that stuff. Yeah. Ask the Lord, who is this? Who is this? Yes. Yes. You better Lord. preach. Who am I talking to? Good God of mine. So this Pharisee says, hey, Jesus, I got, I got a question for you, sir. What is the greatest commandment? Mm -hmm. He asked Jesus, what is the greatest commandment out of 613 commandments? Mm -hmm. Jesus is better than study. <laughs> Amen. Because he's talking to a a studier, he's talking to someone that's well uh, 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 trained in their doctrine, amen, in theology, amen. I, I want to let you know, brothers and sisters, you better study. That's right. Come on, Come on. So when somebody that is studied, but he's not doing it out of love, come and ask him to tell me about yeah. this. Yeah. Uh, can do you have an answer for this? Yes, That's good. What is the difference between Jesus and Muhammad? Mm -hmm. What is the difference between Jesus and Buddha? Are y'all listening to me? Say that. You have people that are studying all religions. Don't, don't let an unbeliever outstudy you. That's right. Don't let an unbeliever tell you more about your God than you can tell him. Are, are y'all listening? You have people that are well trained to argue. Uh -huh, uh -huh. Debate. A great debater. And I'm not mad at them because when you get in the fight, you should be well trained. Right. Uh -huh. You should be well equipped. Yes, sir. Amen. We are in a spiritual warfare. Yes, sir. Yes. Are y'all listening to me, brothers and sisters? Yes, and, and you can't yes, just just live off the word of other people. Talk, talk. You can't just live off the word of people with tight. Yes, sir. Amen. But you got to know God for yourself. Are you getting knocked off? Yes, sir. Uh huh. Says, tell me, Jesus, you call, they call you a rabbi. I mean, you got disciple, a couple of disciples, ain't nothing with our school. He's a fisherman, he's a sinner, a tax collector. You got some ragamuffin here. <laughs> Jesus always take the one that's reject. Come on, yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Thank you, Lord. When he, when he picked his disciples, he, he didn't go out to the higher escalade. He, he went to the thugs. He went to the streets. He went to, to, to the common folk and said, I'll make you into your father. Praise your Lord. Hey, hey. I don't need nobody to make themselves. Yeah. They come follow me. Come on, Lord. I'm God. How can you prepare yourself hey. to follow me? Uh -huh. no, I am the one that will make you. You I'll just follow me. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Thank yes, sir. You, I know you toe up follow me. Yeah. I know you ain't got nothing together. Follow me. Yes, I know your background. Follow me. Yes, I know you got all types of afflictions and addictions, amen, yeah, yeah, yeah. and temptations and that, but just follow, follow. me. Yeah. And when you follow yeah. me, Are, are y'all listening to yes, us? Yes, sir. But all I got to do is go step. I <laughs> step. I step. That's yes, it. But wasn't that, wasn't that the trip yeah. L step? Praise your Lord. Yes, sir. Thank you, Lord. Uh, one day at a time. I don't know what's going to happen tomorrow. I'm just taking one step. Yes, sir. Yes. 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 yes sir. All right. <laughs> so follow me. Anyway, Jesus says, He says, Huh. Out of the 613 laws, huh? It's okay. The first one is love God. Mm -hmm. Love God. 
Love God with all your heart, yes. all your mind, and all your soul. Love God. Everybody got to stick this point it up. Love God. God is where? Up. The Bible says God is high and lifted up. High and lifted up. Love God. Love God. Love up. Love God. Real revival starts. When you love God. Yes. yes. yes sir. Yes, sir. You can't have revival without repentance. Say that. Are y'all listening to me? Uh -huh. You can't have revival without repentance. You can't have revival without wanting to turn away from all of your ways and all of your gods and what you think and what's your theory and what's your doctrine and all that. You got to turn away from all that. And you got to love God. That's it. You got to love God. El Shaddai, Elohim, the creator of heaven uh -huh. and earth. The one that woke you up. The one that's putting breath in your lungs. Why would you not want us keeping you alive? Why would you not love somebody like that? He said, you got to love God. And, and I like how he told us. He told us how to love him. See, some people will tell you to love me, but they won't tell you how. It's all right to be married and tell your spouse how to love you. Because I, God did not leave it up to our assumptions. Right, right, right. Mm -hmm. He said, no, I, I want to be loved with all your heart, all, all your mind, all, all your soul. I want to be loved with everything in you. If you can't love me with everything in you, I don't want you. And now listen to yes, him. He sir. told us yes, how to love him. He did not leave it up, brothers and sisters, to our imagination how to love. And every once in a while, you got to tell people how to love you. Yeah. You got to tell people, I don't like that. Don't you be like that, brother. Don't say that to me. Please stop wearing that to bed. <laughs> no. <laughs> Cause it's love. He ain't there. As you can see, we've had this discussion. <laughs> I gotta tell you how to love me. I gotta tell you what's my appetite. Are y'all listening to me? That's okay. See, see, that's the problem with a lot of us. You ask for people to love you, but you're not telling them. Yeah. Mm. You're not talking. There's no communication. It's good. How can we build a relationship with no communication? Come on. I don't like Cheerios. I like Frosted Flakes, not buying Cheerios. <laughs> that's okay. You said in a loving way, in a nice way, but that's okay. Mm -hmm. That's not a bad thing. No. He says, love them with all your heart. Your heart. My heart, my heart is where my passion is. God said, when you love me, love me passionately. Yeah. Yeah. I want you to be crazy in love. Yes, sir. Crazy in love. See, anything I'm passionate about, I go after. Yes. And y'all listen to me. When, when, when I get passionate about something and I want something, it's not too long that I get it. Because I'm passionate. My passion is my drive. It's my thrust. It's what pushes me after something. Wow. Mm -hmm. God says, I want you to love me so much, yeah. amen, that you seek after me. Yes. Oh, yes. God, right? yes. You run after me. Yes. Amen. Man. You don't get lazy when it's time to worship me. You've been thinking about worshiping me all night. Yes, wow. Come on. You love me with passion. Yes, passion. Passion makes the bed move hot. All right. God, oh, God. God. <laughs> yes. Just, no, passion will come after me. Seek me. Is, isn't that how Jesus loved us? Amen. The Bible says he sought after yes, us. Yes, he came seeking yes, amen, yes, to know that he must have. He yes, came after us. Yes, he yes, stepped yes. out of heaven. Amen. Wrapped himself in flesh. Amen. Oh, Stepped through 42 days. Yes. I'm going to get my yes, children. Yes, I'm going to get yes, my baby. Yes, I got a pastor. He, yes, a pastor. Yes, he came to God. Some of us out of crack houses. Yes, he came to God. Some of us out of gang. Yes, some of us out of prison. Yes, some of us out of prison. Yes, he Yes, got it. Yes, he found you. Yes, 
Yes. Yes. That's what it means to be saved. Mean he found you. You didn't find God. God wasn't lost. God found you. Come on. Yeah. You know how something is, you know when somebody's passionate? When they cry after something. Yeah. Do you know you really want something? When you start crying, I start getting a response from you. Uh, no wonder Jesus, when he looked out on us, he cried. Yes, sir. Mm. You will never get something if you ain't willing to cry for it. Come on, that's good. If it doesn't move you somewhere, you ain't going to get it. Yes, sir. That's right. Now right. y'all listen to me. There has to be some passion. He said, I want some passion in this yeah. love affair. Yeah. I don't want no dead marriage. Come on. I need some passion. Man. I need some calls in the middle of the day. Come on. Yeah. He said, I miss you. No. <laughs> I was just thinking about you. <laughs> <laughs> I, I, I need you just to pull up out of nowhere yes. and say, here, I was thinking about it and I bought you something. Oh, yeah. uh, Amen. If you only come here to worship God, you're not passionate about it. Mm. That's good. If you can go through Monday, Tuesday, and you ain't said nothing to him the Wednesday, you don't have no passion. No passion. No passion. No passion. Yes, say that, say that. I, I know, you. And religion is really about you. Right. Religion is man-made. Right. It's designed to meet your needs. Right. Right. Are y'all listening to me, brothers yes, and sisters? Sir. Yes, sir. But when you're passionate, you wake up talking to God. Yes. Are y'all listening to the bed talking to God? Yes. Are y'all on the way here? You was talking to God. Yes. Amen. Yes. You was getting in the presence of God. Amen. Right. Right. You're passionate. So love. So love. Yes. Good God Almighty. Thank you. Lord. He said, "Love me with your heart." Yes, sir. Then he says. Love me with your soul. Soulful part of you. Not your spirit, your soul. What is my soul? My touch, my taste, my senses. Man is three part being, amen? Mm -hmm. Spirit, soul, and mind. Your soul is what makes you conscious to this world. Teach. He said, I, I want you to love me with that. I want you to love me with that thing that you seek after the world with. See, see, what makes you go after the world is your soul. Yeah. Uh, mm -hmm. The lust of the flesh. Lust of the flesh. Soul. Yes, sir. Lust of the eye. Soul. Uh -huh. Pride of life. Soul. Yeah. He says, I want you to love me so much that that thing that's pulling mm -hmm. on you to come after it, yeah. you say no. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Amen. Yes, sir. Same energy. Yes, sir. Uh, that you go after that job and go after that money and yes. go after that car and go after that woman and go after that man. God says, come after me. Yes, yes. Yes. Do you understand how much your life would change if you just put the same hours in that you put on a job into God? Come on. Mm -hmm. My goodness. You give your job 40 hours a week. Come on, man. How much time do you give God? You give your job eight hours a day. How much time do you give God? Oh, that lets you know what you want. Right, right. Uh, that's good. Are y'all listening to this? He says, come after me with that. Amen. Then he says, come after me with your head. Your mind. Think about me. Are y'all listening to me? Meditate on me. Yes, amen. Yes, amen. Let me be in your thought process. Yes. Are y'all listening to me, brothers and sisters? Yes. Acknowledge me. Mm -hmm. Let let this mind that's in in me be in you. Yes. yes. Be renewed by your mind, yes. by the word of God. Are y'all listening to me, brothers and sisters? Yes. Read the Bible so much that it starts very changing the way you think. You know? yes. Amen. Because if, if I could change, if he could change the way we think, he could change the way we behave. Yes. yes. Amen. Amen. Thank you, Lord. Yes. You think 
You behave because that's how you think. Right. Same right. thing. Right. Right. As a man think up in his heart, so, so is he. If you think you're going down, guess where you're going to go? Down, down, down. <laughs> <laughs> he says, so think about me, though. Yeah. How can you love me and you don't think about me? Mm. You don't even plan for me. Mm. Wow. When you think, you start planning. Mm -hmm. Wow. Yeah. I, 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 I wrote think tanks. Yeah. Yeah. We're planning a year, amen, ahead. We're thinking about it. Mm -hmm. Have you thought about how you go worship God? I've been asking brothers later, I've been on the phone asking, and God been making me ask me this. And I'm asking, how long do you want to live? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Then I, I asked you guys, how long? God, I, you were the only one. And you know what I found out? People don't really think about that. Amen. Amen. Do, Amen. do you have a goal? One twenty. One twenty. Amen. 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 Will you serve the Lord for all those what? Yes, sir. Amen. And that might be a promise. <laughs> you know why I say that? Because because Hezekiah, God told him he was going to die. Yeah. And he told God, "We're in the grave. I can't praise you." And God said, well, if you're going to pray me with your life, i give you 15 more years. Come on. Why should God give you life if you're not using it for him? That's good. Well, why should he give you the day? Why? What does it benefit him? What is his profit by waking you up this morning? Say that. What do I get from you? Know, what, do, what about me? Jesus. What does he get? For making that air go in your lungs. Mm. Oh, and all he wants is love. That's all he wants. He says, so I need you to love me vertical. Y'all hear me, brothers and sisters? Yes, yes. I need you to love me. Love me. Don't hurt me. Don't come against me. Don't say nothing I'm not saying. Yeah. Mm. Why are you saying that about yourself? I didn't say that about you. Yeah. Yeah. Amen. Love me. Don't abuse me. Don't use me. Don't use me for what you can get. And then when I gave it to you, you throw me away. Because I'm going to give it to you. Because I really love you. He said, but love me. Be committed to me. Yes. Are you only going to worship me when I'm doing good in your life mm. and I'm blessing you? Can I get that same hallelujah like my sister, amen? Mm. Even though you went through a hard thing, you still say, I bless you. Can I get that type of love? My God. Yes, Lord. God don't want to be nobody's sugar daddy. Yeah. Are y'all listening to that? Yeah. I shook him out. Pick one. Uh, uh, uh. He don't want to be that. He don't want no one night stand. He don't want no affair. He don't want none of that. He want full commitment. Yes. Full, full. full commitment. That's what you want. Amen. Because I want full commitment. You in? All in. All in. I need you all in. All in or nothing. All in nation. I don't want you halfway. I don't want half for you. And I don't want you to want half of me. Yeah. Do you understand if you only if you only go for the tangible stuff that God will give you, God, you're you're cutting yourself short. short. Yes, yes, you are. If you're only going for God for your mm -hmm. for money and tangible stuff, you're cutting because all those stuff, all those things are fade away anyway. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. God will give you wisdom. He'll talk with you. He'll comfort you. I, I'm starting to find out, my brother, that the things that he gives me that the people can't see is more valuable than the things that I make people can't see. That's right. Amen. Amen. Like peace. Yes. And I'm getting out, so I say, I'm going to have peace and prosperity. I don't care about all that money. Amen. And my house is chaotic. Amen. I can't go to sleep. I got to take bills to go, pills to go to sleep. I'd rather have peace. Yes. In a one bedroom shack. Come yes. on. Are y'all listening to oh. it? Oh. In chaos in a big old house. Hey. Oh, so, 
function. You can't buy peace. Right. Can't buy it. How much does peace cost? Come on. Are y'all listening to me, brothers and sisters? I'd rather really have joy. Yes, sir. Joy. I'd rather have some good joy. Yes, sir. Amen. Hallelujah. Wake up and be happy that I woke up. This yes. Morning. Amen. Not giving this day to the devil. Not giving this day to negativity. But saying, Lord, I bless the name of the Lord at all times. Good morning, my brother. Good afternoon, my yes. sister. I want some joy that when I go through a storm, because I am going to go through a storm. Yeah. Amen. That I won't, amen, get in the storm, start murmuring and complaining. Amen. Get depressed. Amen. But I want to go through a storm saying, amen, if God brought me in, he'll bring me out. Amen. Make it I came in. Make it I go out. But blessed be the name. Of the Lord, I rejoice in all things. So what what I'm going through? Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Anyhow. Anyhow. Yes, Lord. How much does joy cost? Mm. All your mind, soul, strength. I want real love. Amen. I want somebody to really say when they with me. They with me. That's us. That's how much does love cost? Mm. Are y'all listening to me, brothers and sisters? See, it's easy to make people slaves. Mm -hmm. Just give them money. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. But just because they're showing up doing everything that you want them to do, that don't mean they love you. Well done. Well done. Well done. Yes, sir. He says, are y'all still with me? Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Just love up. Yeah. Jesus loved up. Mm -hmm. One of the reasons that Jesus died, listen to me, is because he knew his father loved us. Mm -hmm. His father created us. Him and his father. Mm -hmm. His father did not want his creation to become his enemy. Mm -hmm. ah. Good. It's like having your child mm -hmm. fighting you. Turn against you. I know one of my brothers that got killed by his own son. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. Are y'all listening to me? When Adam fell, Eve fell, that made us enemies to God. Mm -hmm. That's right. That's true. We wasn't cool no more. Are y'all listening to me, brothers and sisters? Yeah. God couldn't hang out with us. He couldn't chill with us. Amen. We, because we weren't cool. Or we didn't connect in the spirit. It wasn't love there. We weren't in unity. Love is unity. Love is harmony. Love is oneness. Mm -hmm. And because God loved us so much, and it broke his heart. I heard somebody say, I had a broken heart. Mm -hmm. When we fell in sin, it broke God's heart. Yes, 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 yes it did. Yes, he knows what he understands it. Mm -hmm. And Jesus loving his father. Yeah. And wanting to please his father. Said, I'll, I'll redeem. Yeah. Mm -hmm. that, that was his motive. Anything you do, brothers and sisters, I mean, your motive is you're doing it for God. Yes, sir. Mm -hmm. right. mm -hmm. Yes, sir. We don't just evangelize because we love people. Because right, right. sometimes I don't love people. Right, 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 right. Let's be honest. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. I don't like you. God told me something the other morning. He said, I posted that. God told me that. I was working out. He said, Mustafa, I want to save those you don't like, though. Right. I don't care if you don't like them. I still want to save them. Right. 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 Amen. Amen. He says, I love God. That's why I died for you. Love up. Then Jesus said, love your neighbor as you love yourself. Get your next, get your next thing. That's horizontal. Y'all see the cross? Mm -hmm. Those two things is very close. So later you can stick it together. <laughs> Amen. But love is is cross. When Jesus said love up, and then he said love your neighbor as you love yourself, yes, he was making a cross. God vertical. Neighbor horizontal. Mm -hmm. 
God says this. Okay, Lord, I love you. I'm with you, Lord. I preach for you. I do all that for you. God said, good. He says, but how you show people you love me. Are y'all listening to me? Yes, sir. Is that you got to love your brother. Yeah. Amen. You can't love me. Mm -hmm. yeah. And hate the one you see. Right. Right. He said, You are a liar. Right. Are y'all listening? See, I love God because God gets to the root of the yes, problem. Uh -huh. God keeps yeah. it real. Amen. Yeah. It's easy to love something you can't see. Right. right. He said, He's Johnson. Yeah. <laughs> he says, But I know you love me. That you love your brother. Yes, sir. Mm -hmm. Yes, sir. All men will know you are my disciples, yeah. not by how you come to church, not by how you preach sermons, right. not by how you sing songs, yeah. not by how you do none of that. Yeah. He says, no, men are going to know you are my disciples by how you love one another. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Amen. I'm making a cross here. Jesus showed his father mm -hmm. how much he loved him yeah. by dying yeah. for you. Yes, yes. Sir. Yes, sir. yes, sir. Yes, sir. He didn't die for himself. Right. He didn't die to get nothing from God. He already had everything yes, from God. Mm -hmm. He didn't need nothing. He's all sufficient. Yeah. So he didn't do it for himself. Yeah. But he tried, he was showing his father, this is how much. I love you. I'll die for thee. Yes, yes, sir. Yes, sir. That's it. That's it. His love went vertical and his love went horizontal. Yes, they hung him high. Yes, sir. Hey, hey. They stretched him wide. Yes, sir. Hung his head. Yeah, well, well, well. Yes, sir. With the world, what we supposed to be showing the world now is how much we love them. Yes. Are y'all listening to me? Yes, sir. Can't you see love moving out of this world? Yes, sir. Anytime I start looking at people as though they are hosts of a disease, that's going to make me not love you. Yes, mm -hmm. right. Get away from me. Right. Six feet, right? Yeah. <laughs> Six feet. But that's a device of the devil to get us not to love each other. Mm -hmm. Don't come around me. No, I can't help you. I don't want you around me. Jesus. Are y'all listening to me, brothers? That is, the Bible says as we keep look uh, deeper in the last days, yeah. love will start to wax cold. cold. People are not even looking at people like human beings. Right. Mm -hmm. That's right. How can you drive past a bunch of tents right, right. with people in them and not do nothing? Yeah. Yet you're a child of God. Will he do that? And how can you do that? How can you walk down East 14 and see your young daughters prostituting as women and never get out and say nothing? Come on. Wow. You, so you ain't passionate. You ain't never drove up and cried. Hallelujah. Where's your passion? Right, right, right. You ain't never seen these young men dropping like flies. And cry. I know it wasn't your son. I know you wasn't related, but it is. It is your son. Because if you don't stop it, it is gonna be your son. Jesus. Catch a spray. And if you don't have an antidote, it's coming right to your house. You ain't saying nothing to her daughter, your daughter next. Yes, sir. Then you're gonna say something. God will do it to you. When we see things that ain't right, it's supposed to break our heart. Because mm -hmm. you love them. Yeah. You're supposed to cry. Yeah. So you can go after them. Yeah. Mm -hmm. We got to love this world. That's right. Yes, we do. You got you to gotta just go to your neighbors. I'll cook dinner for you. Mm -hmm. right. Good work, Pastor. Yeah. I make some cookies. Yep. <laughs> just, just, just spontaneous love. Mm -hmm. Radical love. Yes. 
Yeah. Are y'all listening to me? Yeah. Hey, brothers, I, I know y'all shooting dice and hustling. That's all right. I just cooked a pan of lasagna, though. Yes, sir. Get your money. Yes, sir. Nah, nah, nah. <laughs> I'm joking. Don't say that. Amen. <laughs> Forgive him the lasagna. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Don't tell him, look at you, shame on you. You shouldn't be doing this. Your mama raised you. That ain't the good news. Right, right, right. 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 You can't stop doing it. They're in sin. Yes, sir. You know why sinners sin? Because they're sinners. Sinners. That's why you sin. You were, that's who you are. You know why you're living righteous and tough? Because that's who you are. You're not supposed to be trying to be a Christian. You're supposed to, you are. You're supposed to be one. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. You are Christian. Yes, sir. Yes, you are. Talking, talking, talking good. So good. That's how you're going to get them to hear you. Mm-hmm. Feed them first. Mm-hmm. And then just walk off. <laughs> Feed them again. Yes, sir. And then just walk off. Yes, sir. Mm-hmm. Yes, sir. And then one time I come back and say, you know, I love y'all. Can I pray for y'all one time? Yes, yes. Yes. It was all right, mama. Come on, mama. Yeah. Yeah. Ain't yeah. 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 All right. Those are when souls are. Wow. Yes, sir. The greatest bait you and I can have to bring people in to the kingdom of God is love. love. That's, That's it. it. That's love. That's your bait. That's your bait. When you're doing it, are you doing it from a place of love? You got a vertical, horizontal. He says these two commandments, all the 613 laws, hang on. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. It ain't no reason not to. If you love them, you won't kill them. That's right. Right. If you love them, you won't steal. That's right. If you love God, you won't have another God in front of them. Ain't that simple? See, see I love that God just makes it simple. Uh-huh. Pray. Don't worry about doing this, 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 that, another. Just love. Mm-hmm. Love. Cross. The cross. Is a symbol, vertical, horizontal, of God's love. Now can I tell you what you are the symbol of? God told me to tell you. Tell them what they symbolize. I said, Lord, what do we symbolize? He said, Mustafa, you you know when you play football, you named your team the Trophy Bowl. I love trophies. Are y'all listening to me? Yes, sir. I, 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 my team will tell you, if, if we don't win the trophy, this season was a bust. I don't care how many games you won, all the shoot right. videos we right. shot. Right. And at the end of the day, if we ain't holding that trophy, right. this was for nothing. Because a trophy represents I won. Winning. Yes, sir. I survived. Yes, sir. It was hard. It was a tough fight. Yeah. I got beat up. Yes, sir. I got bruised. Mm-hmm. I trained hard. Yes, I fought hard. But when I held that trophy, it was all worth it yes, because it was a symbol that all I went through wasn't in vain. Yes, sir. Mm-hmm. Yes, sir. Are y'all listening yes, to me? Yes, sir. So he told me to tell you tonight. You know who you are for me? You my trophy. What I did on the cross. The way that it beat me. The way they put crown of thorns in my head. The way they put the nails in my head. The way they mocked me, the way they ridiculed me, the way they spit at me. He says, when I look at you, I realize amen, it wasn't in vain. Yeah. When I see the edge of those feet, start praising me and running the business. It lets me know my blood wasn't in vain. When I see an ex-pimp get out there and start testifying of the goodness of the Lord, it makes me know my blood wasn't in vain. When I see a prostitute go down to the altar and call out for me, it lets me know my blood wasn't in vain. When you look at your life, 
faith, you should see that Jesus won. He defeated the devil. He broke every curse. And he locked up the devil. Yes! Yes, sir. It wasn't your victory. It was his victory. It wasn't your fight. It was his fight. It was a war between good and evil. You're just the trophy, baby. All right. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Right. That's why you're overcome yes, sir. by the blood of the Lamb yes, sir. and the word of your testimonies. Yes. Anytime there's testimony service, you should run up and really testify. Yes, what I mean, really testify. Yes, Don't get up here and just say, I went through things. <laughs> Tell them I was addicted to drugs for 10 years. Yes. I was an alcoholic. I was a prostitute. I was in the game. He got me facing 25 years of life. That's why I tell it everywhere I go. But when I came to Jesus, I was facing 25 years to life. I was a thug. Good God, I was a gangbanger. I was messed up. And good God Almighty, I got caught. But when I called on Jesus, he turned my life all the way around. Boast in your weakness. Boast in your simple ways that the glory of God will be revealed. Don't act like you got here yourself. You cleaned yourself. You made yourself. It had not been for God on my side. I would still be selling though. I would still be smoking. I would still be And now that he polished you, mm. he made you a trophy. Yeah. My God. Now you're sitting there acting like you did it yourself. Jesus. Forgive us, Lord. But if you testify yes, sir. of how good God has been in your life, yes. you'll stay clean. Yes, sir. Yes, God. You'll stay shy. Right. Because when you and I testify, we're showing the devil. Yes, sir. Uh huh. God won. God. Yes, sir. Hallelujah. Yes, sir. One. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Fight. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. That y'all had from the foundations of the world, mm. and he kicked you out. Mm. And you went low and fought his kids. Yes. You sucker. Yeah. 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 He didn't fight God. Right, he right. fought his children. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, sure. He didn't face the man. Right, right. He went after my son. Yeah. Wow. Yeah. 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 Mm. Went after my wife. Right. Yeah. He said, but when you testify, mm -hmm. uh, yeah. he says, you show my one. Yeah. I want you to shine. I don't, I don't wish no more bad thing on you. God's thoughts towards us are good and not yes, evil. Right, that's right. Why? Because I, I, you're my trophy. You want to do one of the things that broke my heart hard in any day is when we was traveling on our way to defend our trophy, and I gave it to a young man to celebrate, and he dropped it and broke it. Broke my heart. Be aware who you put your hand, yourself in the hands of. You're valuable. Yes, yes. Good God of my Good work, good work. Don't put your hands just in your body. Yes, sir. They might drop you. Drop you. Good. Yes, sir. I'm done. The cross yes, sir. represents Whoa. God ain't going to drop you. Yeah. Hallelujah. Thank you. Thank you. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Yes, sir. When God got ready to bless everybody, he said, I swear I'm going to bless you. Yes, he right. did. I swear. Yes, sir. When God got ready to save us, when he put Jesus on that cross, that was God said, I swear I'll yes. save you. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. He ain't gonna drop you. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. He ain't gonna let you go. No, sir. No, sir. Hey, no. It ain't gonna run out. Yeah. It runs in you. That's right. 
The favor ain't gonna run out. Yes, sir. The grace ain't gonna run out. Yes, sir. He said it runs in. We got a thing. It's like your blood. Your blood don't run out. It run in. Yes, sir. Your blood is running right now. Come on. But it's inside. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. It ain't gonna run out. Don't live timid. Yes, sir. You can't love timid. Talk, sir. You got love with everything. Yes, sir. Everything. Yes, sir. When Jesus died, he loved everything. Yes, 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 yes. You can't think of one day this gonna run out. Right, mm -hmm. amen. Give it all. One, one day God gonna, he ain't gonna like me. He gonna right. curse me. Right, right. Cause right. he know I ain't. Right, right, right. Give it all. Right. Yes, sir. Yes, I'm with you. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Always. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, to the yes, end of the world. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. I'm gonna finish what I started. Yes, sir. So they will know. Yeah. Yes, yes, sir. Yes, sir. If you know, this is a personal thing. If you know, when you look at yourself and you look where God has brought you from, if you know, and you can honestly say, Lord, the way you saved me and kept me. You won. Give him some praise. Right? Hallelujah. 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 Hey, I'm going to tell you, y'all, when we won that trophy, we shouted. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Foundation is set. 